Hey everyone, in this video, let's compare exit lag with WT fast and see which one comes out on top. In order to do so, here we are at exitlag.com. And if you are unfamiliar with exit lag, what it is is a way that you can reduce your lag in games. So if you're a gamer and you want to try to uh, increase your ping and just pull out some more performance for those important moments in gaming, then you might want to consider something like exit lag. Uh, we can compare this here with WT Fast. WT Fast is a similar idea, limited lag, faster ping, smoother gaming, and it will help you essentially do the same thing. Now, let's go ahead and just compare the two here as far as pricing goes. So if we just click here on pricing, then you can see that we have with WT Fast a three-day trial that we can uh, try out. And if you're looking to subscribe, it's going to be $3.37 per month. We could compare that here with exit lag. And if we take a look here at the pricing, at the moment there is a sale, but there's no guarantee that that's going to last for long. And you can see here that the monthly price is exactly the same, $13.37 per month for exit lag as well. So why would you choose one over the other? Well, according to my research, there is some uh, evidence that WT Fast does have better performance um, than exit lag. Now, that can vary from person to person. It can vary from game to game. But uh, that seems to be the general consensus is that uh, WT Fast, you might get better performance. The difference being is that WT Fast doesn't support every single game. And also there is some concern about the interface, which some people find a little bit more confusing than exit lag. So those are a couple things to take into consideration. If you're looking to pull more performance out, you might want to consider WT Fast, but it's also possible that the game that you are looking to play might not be supported. So it's important to do a little bit of research and find out for sure before you choose either between WT Fast and Exit Lag. Exit Lag seems to be in uh, many uh, respects the kind of industry standard, um, but uh, you know it depends on who you're you're uh, asking. But with Exit Lag, it seems as though it does support more games but the results might not be as consistent as something like WT Fast. But ultimately, the price is pretty much the same. So when you're comparing the two, if you're looking for better performance, you might want to go with WT Fast. If you're looking for something that is a little bit more accessible in terms of the interface, then you might want to consider exit lag. And that's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment and like and subscribe for more helpful tips.